I feel the most powerful when I'm on a bike. It's a break from the chaos. It's a break from pain. It's just a moment to catch your breath. I feel unstoppable. I feel me. But there's always a little bit of doubt until you actually see something tangible, something physical. And with the technology we use in the fitting process, it's being able to see the changes that you've implemented and see that they're stronger and feel what is better for you. I'm a Paralympic cyclist and I'm a two-time Paralympic bronze medalist, five-time world champion, two of which is current double world champion. So effectively, I have a shorter and smaller right leg compared to my left leg. So it's always played some sort of part in sport. I started cycling with my dad when I was about six years old. We would ride, we would train together, my dad and I would race, my mom would film. So it wasn't just the love for cycling, it was the love for the community, it was love for my family, it was all of these things that correlated into it. I met my husband Andrew at the same time that I started paracycling. It was a nice feel after a hard ride. Andrew's helped me be a better athlete because he's been there for me emotionally. But he's also been there because he geeks out on bikes. He's always been a huge advocate for a professional bike fit. I didn't realize, honestly, the importance of a proper fit until I got one and we didn't realize how much technology could play a part in optimizing that bike fit until we met Porik. Porik's fit me since 2018 and he's changed our lives. We did 1,200 fit appointments last year. That was 1,200 people we got to touch their cycling experience. We got to use all this technology to help them be better. In the early 90s, I was a racing cyclist back in Ireland, and I got into the technology side of it when I realized that a lot of what happened out there was actually purely subjective. So things like hanging a plumb bob off somebody's nose to figure out how long the handlebars on a bike should be. When people tell me, hey, we just do it this way, that's not good enough for me. And that's been my 30-year mission to find out, okay, how can we pull science into it and do it in a methodical way? And because cycling is a very dynamic motion, the more data we can have about where the joints are and how the muscles are moving through the range of motions, the more accurate we can be. 3D camera technology means that we can look at both sides of the body simultaneously. We can gather a massive amount of information almost instantaneously. To have that technology is just continuing to change the game. What really kind of turbocharged our development process was when we found Orbeck as a company and specifically the Femto Mega camera. If you're doing the hard work, why wouldn't you use the technology to find the best fit to really let that hard work shine? We're treating every single person as a complete individual. We don't ever try and say, this person has X characteristic, therefore we're going to have a Y thing happen to their bike fit. It's much more organic and it's much more complex than that. And technology really allows us to peel back the layers of all the subjective stuff and go, what does this person need for their situation today? Physically it was tough and Emotionally, it was harder. I was a little afraid that I wouldn't ride a bike again, that I wouldn't want to ride a bike again. After I was hurt, Port called, he checked in. How's your strength improving? He tried to arrange times when we could come out. Let's get you up on the bike and let's figure out what's going on. So he did all these things to make it work for what I was currently going through. And it just felt like a big warm hug. <laughs> Samantha's an amazing human being. She's incredible. It's gonna stabilize and then we'll grab 15 seconds of data. Without him, I know that I wouldn't be where I am today. I know that I wouldn't have become a world champion and have all the success under my belt. Wow, we have come a long way. <laughs>
Thanks. Yes, we have. Super cool. But now my favorite medal is the World Championship medal I won in 2022 because I came from rock bottom. Now let's talk about what this 3D camera has got us. So to be a small piece of Sam's success or any athlete's success, that to me is the most amazing feeling to be a part of that. Your joints are where they need to be and everything you've done, all the hard work, it's phenomenal. <laughs> right? I'm getting choked up here too. We see knee replacements, we see hip replacements, we see spinal fusions, we see amputees, we see a wide range of people with different things going on. When that person is reconnected with that joy of being on a bicycle and being back doing something that's so simple yet so profound, that person's life and their health is permanently changed.